Hi, my name is Jim with Hobie, and today I'll be talking to you about the new 2020 kickup fins. So for the kickup fins, which are on our GT Mirage Drive and our MD180 Mirage Drive, we've equipped these with the feature of a breakaway fin. The primary reason for the breakaway fin is to protect the drive. So if you were to hit an underwater obstacle or the ground, with the drive, you wouldn't want to damage the mast or the drive. So the, the basic function of the, the fin is when you in, in hit that obstacle, they'll break away. It takes quite a bit of force, anywhere between 12 and 25 pounds to break away the fin. And over time, that amount of force can change as this plastic becomes worn down due to uh, hitting uh, the ground or um, just in use, it may become a little bit looser over time. And if it does become loose, we've equipped the drive with a replaceable set screw, which is right here. When you adjust the, the set screw to increase or adjust the amount of kickup force, you always want to do that when the fin is kicked up. So if I wanted to increase the, the amount of force, I would insert my Allen wrench, which is included with your kayak, turn it about a quarter of a turn. You don't want the set screw to push too far into the boom. Just want it to stick out a little bit so that it'll engage in this feature right here on the mast link. And then re-engage and you can feel it move past the set screw and snap into place. And that is plenty of adjustment to, to provide the resistance keep the fin from kicking up inadvertently. You only want the fin to kick up when you actually hit an object. You don't want the fin to kick up while you're uh, just pedaling along. Otherwise, the fins may interfere with each other as you're pedaling. The set screw is made out of a soft nylon material. The boom that the fin is attached to is made out of a very hard, high fiberglass reinforced engineering nylon. So the strongest material is the boom, and that means that the set screw is the sacrificial part. If you were to over tighten the set screw, you will not strip the threads in the boom. You would strip the threads or the Allen key fitting in the set screw. Uh, so that makes the set screw a replaceable sacrificial part. 